Today we're going to take a look at the Sunlu Filler Dryer S2 filament dryer for FTM printers. So here we have the machine, we have a touchscreen at the front. On the top we have two exit points for your filament so you can feed direct to a uh, FTM printer. These both have Teflon inserts and this does come with a pack of spares. On the rear we have the power lead and inside the machine we can see that the heater element is distributed right across the bottom of the machine. So here I have a reel of Bamboo Labs PLA mat filament that places into the machine like so. And we also look on the lid, you can also see that the filament continues to wrap around on the top, providing heating all the way around the filament. So we go down to the touch screen. Now here, you have to be quick on here. If you do too slow, it doesn't work. So you have to be qu quite a quick press. Use set. I can switch between uh, Fahrenheit or Celsius. If I scroll down to the material type, by scrolling through the materials, you can see that the set point temperature changes according to the material type. So if I scroll down to PLA, move down one, you can turn the LED outer ring either on or off. Personally, I prefer it off. <coughs> so, in here, this is quite quiet to run. So, if I compare this to my uh, Creality uh, Filament Dry Box 2.0. See if I just try and turn this on here. So you can hear that this is considerably more noisy than this. Yeah. What I would say personally is a uh, downside to this filament dryer is that the controls and the power at the sides of the machine. So you cannot stack the machines this way side by side. Whereas with the Creality I can do. So I hope you found this video useful.